Out your John Sword. My name is Karin. This is Kuroki. We've been dating for three years and we are finally getting married. Do you take Karin as your wife? To love her, to cherish her, nurture her and support her? In both times of joy and in times of difficulty? Do you promise to remain by her side regardless of what trouble befalls you? And with all your heart and soul to honor this vow? Till death do you part? I do. Miss Karin, do you take Mr. Kuroki as your husband? To love him, cherish him, nurture him and support him in times of joy and difficulty? With all your heart and soul to honor this vow? Till death do you part? Yes, I do. Hold it right there! Huh? Karin! I'm here to pick you up! Hiroki? Wait, what? Who is that? My ex. Huh? What does that mean? Is this a scene from a soap opera drama? That means what? What does it mean? Hold on a second. I'm confused too. The day has finally come. I've been waiting for this day for so long. Karin, remember how you always used to say... You know the scene where a girl is about to get married to someone she doesn't love, and just when they are about to finish their vows, her true love comes in and says, hold it right there? It's my favorite cliché. And the time has come. Karin, I can finally take you away. Huh? Wait, does that mean he's the one you truly love? No way, right? <sighs> hey, Karin, please tell me this isn't true. Karin? Let's go, Karin. Hidegi, you agreed back then when we broke up, didn't you? And yeah, I did say something like that in the past. But you still can't tell the difference between fiction and reality, huh? What you're doing here is not dramatic or romantic, just in case you didn't know. You're just crashing a wedding and causing people trouble. That kind of disgusting narcissism is exactly why I broke up with you in the first place. <gasps> huh? What? Disgusting? Huh? But to make your favorite cliché a reality, we had to break up first, right? That's why I was enduring the pain this whole time just to make your dream come true. Oh, I get it. Even your anger. It's all part of the act, isn't it? What? I see, I see. And I should move on to the next scene, shouldn't I? All right, let's go. Yeah! Time to have the wedding of our dreams. Karin! Heave ho! Damn it! Let go of Karin! Damn it! Hey, where the hell are we going? Let me off! We're going to our wedding, honey. You're crazy. You're just gonna get arrested for kidnapping me. Shut up! You don't know how much I've been waiting for this day. I will never let you go again. Four years ago. Hideki, thank you for waiting. Hey, Karin. You look beautiful as always. After meeting him at the matchmaking party, I first thought he was romantic and a wonderful gentleman. I'm sorry. I knew this would be in your way during the date, but... I bought a bouquet of roses again. Will you accept it? Every time we met, he would bring a wonderful present and always come up with a date course I would enjoy. He also had the looks and had a wonderful sense of fashion. He would always talk smooth like a gentleman in the movies. At the time, I felt like the heroine of a romantic movie. But then, I started realizing how abnormal he was. You chartered the whole restaurant? Yeah, remember you told me? You wanted to try having dinner at an expensive chartered restaurant while enjoying the night view. That was when we were watching a movie together. Don't take it seriously. I feel so out of place just coming to such an expensive restaurant like this. My dress is cheap too. By the way, I got the suite room for the hotel we will stay at tonight. Huh? Hey, you're always doing so much for me every time, but where do you get all that money? Please don't tell me you're in debt. Debt? I've been in debt forever. Huh? Well, you're the one who said it first, right? Chartering a restaurant and staying at a suite room? My desire in life is to make all your dreams come true. I was just admiring the thought. I got scared and told him that I wanted to go on dates at more affordable places and pay half of everything. That was when I saw his terrifying side for the first time. Are you trying to take away my purpose in life? 
After that, the once wonderful gentleman Hideki started looking more and more like a monster to me. I broke up with him to escape his heavy love. But I should have realized it was strange back then. I see. If that's what you wish. Okay, let's break up. That this man gave in that easily. Where are we? I'm sorry that this was all that I could prepare for you. It's an abandoned building now, but it used to be a wedding chapel before. I'm sad that I couldn't invite anyone, but there was nothing I could do about it. If we announced the wedding ceremony, that Kuroki guy would find out too, right? A secret wedding ceremony at an abandoned building with an abducted bride? How divine! How romantic! Look, I have a ring too! No, let me go! Hey, settle down! <sighs> this is what you wanted, right? I'll make all your dreams come true. So listen to me. Don't resist, okay? This is all my fault. I was stupid for not noticing how crazy this guy was. Aren't you happy? We're going to be united soon. Now I shall kiss the bride. Stay away from Karin! You criminal! Kuroki? This is the police! You are under arrest! What? How did you find this place? Kuroki! I was so scared. I'm so sorry. I froze up. You're safe now. Oh no. It's because I said things that confused him. We were looking forward to this day for so long. I ruined it. I'm so sorry. Um, I'm asking just in case, but you're really over that guy, right? Of course I am. You knew that, right? That's why you came to help me. Karin. Kroki. <laughs> that night. Man, what a day. Yeah, seriously. But really, I'm so glad that guy took your bag with him. I wonder what I would have done without the GPS on your smartphone. I was so confused with the situation and couldn't take action right away. I'm disappointed I couldn't do much. You did nothing wrong, Kuroki. I'm the one who caused this. I'm sorry it caused so much trouble. But honestly, I found it very manly and sweet. That guy? No way! Of course I'm talking about you! Oh. It's true that I used to daydream about situations like that. So you actually... that guy... I said no, dummy! You too. You did the same thing today. You didn't realize? <gasps> today... You were cooler than I've ever seen you. Thank you, Kuroki. <sighs> but to think that the GPS we put on because of that fight would help us like this. I'm telling you, I just went out drinking with my coworker from work. I'm not cheating on you. Oh, really? Then let me drag you with the GPS app from now on. Yeah, go ahead. I have nothing to hide. Then I'll put mine on too, just to be fair. Fine. It became a wedding that I would never forget. ご視聴いただきありがとうございました。挙式中に元恋人がちょっと待ったーと乱入してくる演出はドラマや映画の世界だから成立するものですからね。現実でやってしまうと当人同士の問題ではなくなりますし、たくさんの方に迷惑をかけてしまうだけです。やっていいことと悪いことの区別はちゃんとしないとダメです。皆さんはどう感じましたかコメント欄に書いていただけると嬉しいです。またこんな結婚式は嫌だなぁと思った方、チャンネル登録と高評価をお願いいたします。